Hey guys, so today I am here to talk about Styron Res. Styron Res is the new primer coming out from Badger Airbrushes. Now this is some great stuff. This here is a sample bottle, but you'll see the label on the side over there, or is it over there? Either way, doesn't matter. Anyways, I've been working uh, with this stuff for about a month now, and I've been spraying everything. It's crazy. This stuff is awesome. I really like it, but really it's up to you to decide when you pick up your own bottle. But here I am here to talk about how this stuff works. It goes through the airbrush really smooth. We'll take a look at that. When the sucker dries and it's cured, I mean, it's really hard to rub off. So let's check it out. So the first thing we'll do is see how well it flows out of the brush. Here I'm using the Patriot 105 with a fine detail conversion set. This basically means we're sporting a 0.3 nozzle size fitting. It flows out of the airbrush straight from the bottle with no problems. It conforms to my trigger control pretty well. From wide lines to narrow lines, it doesn't seem to be clogging even though it's going through a brush with a detailed conversion set installed. Let's try covering up the model with this stuff and see how well it does. Even with a smaller nasal size installed, I'm getting really good coverage here. One pass seems to be all I need in most of the areas of the model. Now here's a model I covered with primer and it's already been cured. I'm using a toothpick here to really scrape the surface of the model. It's pretty tough stuff here. You'll also see some scratches I made earlier. I made these scratches right after spraying it. Of course that's going to happen, the primer was still wet. I find that the primer dries to the touch pretty quick, depending on how much you put on. From playing around with it, the primer cures within the hour, again depending on how much you slap on. As with all primers, I usually wait a couple hours before doing anything with the model after priming it. This is Stein Reds coming out of Badger and it's making its debut at Adepticon in a week from now. So if you're going to Adepticon, make sure you save up or put some money aside to get you know your very own bottles. They come with uh, three colors so far. It's white, gray, and black. And I believe that's all they're going to stick to right now. So we'll know more later on. They come in two ounce bottles or four ounce bottles. Two ounce, four ounce. Okay, so it's some good stuff, so I can't wait for you guys to, you know, get your hands on it and try it out. We got, uh, you know, a group that's been testing stuff, and they've been saying nothing but uh, great things about it. So that's it, guys. I'll get my hands on the uh, other colors, and we'll go through a real little test run to it in a later video. But this is some really good stuff, and I'm liking it. That's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed And remember, if you're going to Adeptcon in a week, don't forget to stop by the Badger booth and get your primers as well. The WGC booth is right next to the Badger booth. So hopefully we'll see you there. Talk to you guys later.